Well, Bajaj Auto came out with a decent set of earnings this time, majorly in line to what we were expecting at ET Now. The revenue came in at 11,485 crores, EBITDA clocked in at 2,305 crores, and the margins were almost flat on a YY as well as on a quarter on quarter basis at 20%. Talking about the profitability, 1,936 crores is what the company has reported, slightly better than what we were expecting at ET Now. But some of the internals look uh, quite positive. Because the company did say that the margins helped steady despite the significant investments on expanding their electric scooter business. The 125 cc plus segment has been doing really well, and that registered four times growth versus rest of the industry in the quarter gone by. The commercial vehicle sustained its uh, sales trajectory, more than uh, one lakh of sales being clocked uh, yet another quarter. In the e3 wheeler, the company did expand its network to 60 cities now versus 23 in Q3. And the Chetak also delivers its highest quarterly volume. Uh, talking about the Triumph volumes, that has also stepped up further. Nearly 18,800 units being delivered in this quarter, and 70% of the volumes is going in the overseas market. And the company is also working to unlock the capacity in the next few months, specifically for the Triumph to cater to the demand in the domestic as well as exports market. So all in all, a decent set coming in from Bajaj Auto. uh the commentary is quite positive as of now and the numbers were seen to be in line